Hey everyone, it's Jack the Obsessed Movie Man. I know I said I was going to take a break from YouTube, and I am, but I just wanted to give you an update on what's going on for the 100th episode. And as I said before, it's going to be on King Kong, and I'm taking this very seriously since King Kong's my favorite film. So what I did is, I used this is um, a really cool King Kong book, um, The History of a Movie Icon from Faye Ray to Peter Jackson. And I actually got this book when the Peter Jackson movie came out, but the funny thing is that's not the one that I originally had because at some point I lost this book and so when I decided I'm doing the 100th review I wanted to get more research notes done, more research notes and I ordered the book, I, I found it on Amazon and purchased it so that's going to be one of the, that's going to be one of the main sources of information along with the movie because I'm going to rewatch the movie, actually before the whole COVID thing, the last movie I saw in theaters was King Kong. They released it, and I got to see it with CTQ. And I'm going to watch it again. And the special editions. This came with the box set years and years ago. And that's actually going to be a good source of information as well. It goes more into Willis O'Brien and the work that he did. And I don't know if I've ever shown this off, but this is the review notebook. When I, Whenever I watch a movie for reviews... I just take notes in this. This still has like, um, I don't know which, the, yeah, the first one, Breakfast at Tiffany's, because I had other notebooks before. And the thing about this review is we're going to use some, we're going to at least attempt to do some sort of effects. It's not going to be like recreating the whole movie. It's just paying homage to the effects. It's going to be like three scenes. So I've come up with some sketches. This is still not guaranteed that it'll be in the review. But I'm trying at least. Um, me and CTQ. CTQ, by the way, helped make the Oz head. And hopefully in the future we'll be doing a tutorial on how to make it. Because I know some people have asked how to make the Oz head. We want to try and make a King Kong hand. And we're going to have an actor or actress be in the hand. For when they Kong picks them up. Another scene I want to attempt to try is the log scene. We're thinking of doing rear projection like they did in the original with the Kong stop motion. We have no idea how we're going to do this log scene, if it'll be entirely stop motion, or if we'll have live action actors working off of the rear projection screen. But we're at least coming up with it. And the last thing I want to tr say that we're going to try is the Empire State Building scene with the airplanes. We want to try, at least I want to try and see if we can at least make a cockpit. So yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update. I'm sorry for the lack of content. I want to give you guys content while I'm working on this. Um, but I'm doing the best I can with under the circumstances with COVID, um, a job and all that. But I am taking the 100th episode very seriously because I want to give all the respect I can to my favorite film of all time. And it might be a pretty long review because I just love King Kong that much. And yeah, this is the Kong we'll be using for the stop motion, because good luck trying to find a King Kong armature that's cheap. But yeah, I wanted to give you guys an update. Um, thank you for being patient with me, and I hope you all are staying safe. Take care.